back to the channel. Thanks for stopping by. If this is your first time, welcome. Glad you can be here. Today I'm checking out a highly, highly, highly recommended track from a dude called Ed Scissor. I know I've, I've, re I've reacted to him a couple times, not on his own. This will be his first solo track that I've done. He's been part of a couple other uh, compilations. Um, and, you know, the dude's not talented. The song uh, Theremin, it has... Uh, Dirty Dyke producing and Sammy, uh, DJ Sammy B side, uh, providing the cuts, and those two, and those two dudes, are absolutely uh, super talented. So I'm excited to get in on this, and 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 give Ed his his uh, his first solo track. So let's see what he's got for me. Loving that crackle of the old vinyl and that violin. I, it might not be a violin, it could be another instrument, but it's just got that horror movie type of feel. You know, and it's giving me a sense of what kind of song this is going to be. So I, I'm getting ready to buckle up here. So. <laughs> I mentioned in my leaf, my last leaf, leaf dog song, the Sammy B side. You know, because of all the great producers and stuff in the UK, he probably doesn't get as much recognition as as other guys do. But yeah, listen to those cuts. This is sick. <laughs> And I got this, I'm going to have to strap in for this one. Deep in a mystic pit, deeper than I've never been, deeper than, what do you say? Deeper than anabolic, than even anabolic fetuses even dream. I think I got that. I don't know, but. It's gonna be one of those, man. It's gonna be one of those. It went like this. Deep in the mystic pit, deeper than I've ever been. Deeper than the anabolic fetuses that never dream. Deeper than the feeble little carcasses that never scream. The silence of the lambs inside the guillotine. Even if an atom bomb was soaring to a setting scene, I'll be walking on with till the laser beams envelop me. Walking on with till the shrub. Pardon me. In scene, I'll be walking on with till the laser beams envelop me. Walking on with till the shrapnel takes my face off me. Walking on with mankind versus green machines. Never face the feet, never let. Man, this has this like Terminator type of thing. Talking about laser beams, walking on part of his face being sheared off. Human beings against the gray machines. It's either, well, machines, so it's not alien. This would be. Like Terminator, I guess they could be machine aliens, I suppose. But I'm guessing maybe where he's going with that line is like the rise of technology, AI, and all that stuff. Um, that's a dope line. I'll be walking on with till the laser beams envelop me. Walking on with till the shrapnel takes my face off me. Walking on with mankind versus green machines. Never face the feet, never let the doom set. Never dig a deeper hole, settle where the guns kept. Every single moment in this epoch. <laughs> Never dig a deeper hole, settle in where the guns are kept. Never dig a deeper hole, settle where the guns kept. Every single moment in this epoch is not done yet. Every single organism twitching as the sun sets and as the sun bled. I ran red the birds saw the flames and abandoned the love nest. The... Oh my god. The guy is writing a friggin' sci-fi novel in a rap song. The humans, every like human being 
is twitching as the sun is setting. He's talking about the, the sun is as the sun is setting, it's bleeding. And it's like I guess that's like a you know has has a double meaning because you know like sometimes when the sun sets, the sky gets red and stuff. So, but then also talking, you know, talking about the bloodshed as well in this war that they're having. And all the blood, and all the birds flee the love nest. The sun bled, a brand red, the birds saw the flames and abandoned the love nest. The seasons deleted, the seeds as the legions of people bereaved all the evil will come next. It came forth shining on horizons, Taurus on the fourth floor crystallized in silence. Word on the street is the. <laughs> so machines would like shine in the sun and stuff, and it's coming on the horizon and it's shining like. On horizons, Taurus on the fourth floor crystallized in silence. Word on the street is the death is their assignment. Lasers and nerve gas methods to divide us. Every single human being, every single one of us, every single heart was beating faster than a fizzing slug. And so we battled for a hundred months, molecules in bark to a cold, and now your lungs are fucked. A hundred bucks doesn't mean shit now. A dozen canned goods for a dozen men sit down and pipe up. It's funny. That line there kind of, you know, a hundred bucks doesn't mean shit now. That's like, it gets you really thinking, especially during the time that we're in now. It's just like, just how, uh, how fragile everything, everything is, really is. Like, if there ever is this total collapse, this, this war, um, you know, the lungs are being filled up, people are dying. It doesn't matter how much money you have in the bank, because that $100 is not going to be worth shit now, as Ed says. A box doesn't mean shit now. A dozen canned goods for a dozen men sit down and pipe up. Join hands and cry blood. Ask for forgiveness, resistances rise up. Two by fours meet metallic skulls and rebound like two point layups in a drunken little. Two by fours hitting metallic skulls. Mm. Join hands and cry blood. Ask for forgiveness. Resistances rise up. Two by fours meet metallic skulls and rebound like two point layups in a drunken little street fight with two prime suspects in a tunnel vision treehouse with two types of honey in the belly of the beehive. And now the president's on speed dog, reading from the pages of his gold leaf Bible book, sending out a message to the front line to keep up the good work and pray that the. Thoughts and prayers, man. Thoughts and prayers. <laughs> President's on speed dial. You know, then he's going to come up to the podium. He's going to open his book. Thoughts and prayers. Meanwhile, the people on the front line. Keep up the good work on the front line as people are dying and offer thoughts and, thoughts and prayers. Bible book. Sending out a message to the front line to keep up the good work and pray that the mothership will lead to its warheads the force fields light up the sky like gunpowder plots on the 4th of July but the force field stays strong for a metal sweating on the rockets information like swans in the night time and demise tastes real in the blood bank triple O neck sorry I, I'm not positive for what <laughs> I did I did dig that um uh, swans in the nighttime uh, line, but I just want to pause and, and comment on this video because it is top notch, man. Whoever whoever did this video, I apologize if I missed it if they said it at the beginning, but damn, I mentioned a few songs back that every single aspect of UK hip hop, they're killing it, man, and that includes. The video production the stuff that comes out like this is unbelievable uh, visuals to go with the song can't say enough and i want to hear this uh i want to hear the swan verse or uh, lining Die, but the force field stays strong for a metal sweating on the rockets information like swans in the night time 
Let them eyes taste real in the blood bank. Triple O negative is running low and hearts need the sustenance to beat back. Foraging for berries in these bleak black tunnels of this monolithic heat tank. We sank deeper than the sun is affirmed. The bleak heat for descended as the populace burned. Stood looking for an echo as these colonies churn the sky yellow. He's talking about, if I, if I caught that correctly, talking about going like deeper than even the sun can shine as as like the world burns above them monolithic heat tank we sent deeper than the sun is affirmed the bleak heat for descended as the populace burned stood looking for an echo as these colonies churn the sky yellow the merriments of montgomery burns top gun tom cruise so is <laughs> this may be completely wrong but Montgomery Burns, is that like Monty Burns from The Simpsons and the nuclear power plant? And is that what he's talking about? The fact that it's like, go, the thing is go nuclear? Is that what he's, is that what he's, uh, what he's meaning by that? Burn the sky yellow, the merry mints of Montgomery Burns. Top Gun, Tom Cruise, pilots shot down. Corkscrews punishing this lifeless plumage. I saw hundreds pulled apart by the ribcage. Man grew haggard, grew bloated by the bruises. And this mere flesh here, this mere flesh wasn't built like a nine foot cyber savage stalking. It wasn't built like a fine tuned sentinel with. <laughs> oh, this flesh here wasn't built. Like these metal sentinels. Hmm. Nine foot metal killers. A nine foot cyber savage stalking. It wasn't built like a fine tuned sentinel with fume vents zigzagging faster than endorphins. Right hook swinging like a bag full of spanners, straight glimmering in color till the blood grew layered than the pistons that churned at the summit of the balance kept turning and moving and heating and burning. Slugs from the parapet, nothing to the 10 speed quaking in your boots with a trench foot bulbous. Celebrating Polaroids a generation gaps in this minute, every minute just a minute from the landslide. Light up the sky, hang out in the mines, put five bullets in your family tonight, say why or oh why. Hiding out in the mines. Put five bullets in your family tonight. <laughs> one of my one of my favorite movies is uh, Twenty Eight Days Later, and I finally showed it to my daughters the other night. And there's that scene where he goes home and he finds his parents in bed. And they've killed themselves rather than, than dealing with the apocalypse outside their windows. And like that scene really, I mean, I find that scene so powerful and, and it had an effect on my daughters as well. So that's kind of where he's getting at, right? Rather than fighting the war, you know, the nine foot sentinels are outside the door about to break it down. You know, rather, rather than having to deal with the savagery and, and watching your kids and your family killed, be the man and put in five bullets and taking care of the job yourself so they don't have to suffer. In the mines, put five bullets in your family tonight. Say why or oh why did the maker decide that this android hell of on the right here tonight? Light up the sky, hang out in the mines. Put five bullets in your family tonight. Say why or oh why did the maker decide that this android hell of on the right here tonight? We're trapped in the belly of this horrible machine. <laughs> Thank you to everybody that recommended that song. <laughs> what an absolute masterpiece. The beat, the cuts, the friggin' the, the artistry of the words that he chose and the way that he put them together, the, the way that they were delivered. 
it was it, it was a, a novel it was a movie I called that uh, that song a couple videos ago an, al an almost perfect, if not a perfect hip hop song. And again, this one is right up there, man. Outstanding in every sense of the word. Thank you for introducing it to me. I appreciate it. Keep them coming. The recommendations and the likes and the subs i was doing this for a little bit of fun now i'm getting close to 400 subscribers guys you're you're great you guys love love your music and i love it too and i'm i'm happy that you're here until next time i think i might do some four owls next time four owls until next time stay safe and be good to each other